What's up guys, Alec here, and today I'm gonna to talk about an Instagram hack which is new to me, and I'm sure it's gonna be new to a lot of you, which basically helps you beat the algorithm and helps you boost your reach and engagement on Instagram. So, like I said, this little hack is actually a feature within Instagram, but it's kind of a discreet feature. I had heard of it before, but I had never really played around with it, never really did any research into it. Recently, I started playing around with it, and I did some research online on Instagram, kind of everywhere about the whole subject, and this is what it is. Instagram alt text. So basically, alt tags is alternative text tags. What it does is that it helps describe your post to people that are visually impaired. So people that won't be able to read your caption and people that won't be able to see your post. If you put alternative text, they'll be able to then hear this. This text is then read out to them and then they kind of understand what your content is about. But as well as helping the visually impaired, alt tags also help businesses such as Google and Facebook find out what pictures are about. What's up guys, Alec here. This is me editing again, editing the video. I explained this really badly, but basically Google uses alt tags to rank photos within its platform. Uh, if you go on Google Images and you search something, because there's no words on a photo, a lot of the time you'll find that photo through alt tags. If you're familiar with WordPress at all and coding, alt tags is a massive thing when it comes to ranking your page on Google. So basically, Basically, this is search engine optimization and all tags on Instagram, uh, basically like Instagram SEO. So yeah, back to the video. So Google and Facebook and other machines need alt tags to be able to read what a picture is about. Basically, if you think about it, all tags are kind of like hashtags, but a, a little bit of a more complex version. But this means that Instagram is also potentially reading alt tags of a certain picture. For an example, if you're going to post a travel photo, you might want to add some alternative tags about that travel photo. You might want to describe it a little bit more within the alternative text and Instagram then might read this alternative text and say like, look, this post we can see it's about travel and we also realize it's about travel thanks to the alternative tags. Then they might take this post and push it a little bit more towards the explore feed and under the explore travel feed. This means that you get more reach, more engagement. Using alternative tags can potentially help you be favored by the algorithm. So now I'm gonna show you how it works. So I'm gonna post on one of my pages and I'm gonna show you the whole process, so why not? So on the explore feed, I find a picture that I like. I copy the link and then I use an app called Workflow and then a little bit of coding to help me basically download the picture straight away from Instagram. Um, I then remember the username, I go to post it on Instagram from my own, um, well yeah, I go to post it on Instagram basically from the account. Then I type out the caption, um, like I'm saying like, wow, this is amazing. Um, then I have my special shortcuts for all my hashtags and the description. Um, I put yay or nay to hopefully boost the engagement on that post. Um, emojis to make it stand out. Then I credit the owner of that photo. Um, I've spoken, I think I've spoken to this person before in the DMs and everything anyway. Um, so I credit them in the photo. Um, I struggled to find a username for a bit here. Um, but then I, I ended up finding it pretty soon. Um, so I just speed this bit up. Okay, then I separate my hashtags. I always keep mine in the post. Okay, now as you can see here, you've got everything. You've got like the tag people, you've got the ad location, you've got all the other accounts you can post to, you've got the Facebook, Twitter. Then right down at the bottom, you can see in light gray text, the advanced settings. And then when you go onto your advanced settings, um, you've got all these extra ones. You've got turn off commenting, share your post to Facebook, and then you've got the alt text. And it's written like accessibility, write alt text. So then you basically just go into this and then you start describing what your post is about. So obviously I start typing in things about the bedroom. So I just say um, cozy, cozy bedroom um, decorated with fairy lights. And basically people who are interested in this type of content are a lot more likely to see this pushed to their explore feed because Instagram knows that those people like fairy lights. And then Instagram also knows that my post contains fairy lights because I've described it with the alternative text. So yeah, that's pretty much the hack. As you can see, I posted it here. Once you've posted it, you can then go back to your post and you can always edit the alternative text later. And by the way, you can only add alternative text to photos, you can't add it to videos. But that is the hack for today. Alternative text is great because Instagram is a lot more likely to favor you and to help you beat the algorithm and it's also good for the visually impaired. That means they get to see your content, know what your content is about and you're tapping into a whole new audience, a whole different audience that um, can't see your content or that isn't able to see your content as well.
So that being said, that's the end of the video. If you like this video and you want to see more, hit the like button down below, comment all your thoughts and questions in the comment section down below, hit the subscribe button down below, and again guys, thanks for watching, peace out. It's just another Hollywood weekend